Welcome everyone to the Bahamas here on Q's TV. Brian Higgins, Coach Q. We're outside uh, St. George's High School after the Orange just beat East Carolina 69-58. And Q, this one, you yeah, got the big lead early and were able to really keep a nice margin the whole game. Yeah, it's no question. We did a very good job of competing the whole game. We knew they would come after us. We knew they would play tough. They would get out and press us. And we just did a very good job of controlling tempo, getting getting, getting good shots, and, and our defense was very good. The main thing when you're playing a pressing team like this, I mean, you were working on it in practice. You beat it in practice the last couple days, and it, it looked like when you beat it early in the game, it took the Pirates completely out of what they do. It's no question. When you, when you, when you beat pressure, you, you have to attack on the back end. And we did a very good job of just c continuing to, 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 to put pressure on their, on their second line, their press, and, and attack the rim. If you get a team like that that averages about 77 points a game and you keep them down in the 50s, you did an excellent job on defense also. You knew you were going to get some open early threes. You got them for Brandon Butler, which is a double good thing. She makes three for you early, really got it going. Well, whenever whenever she scores the ball, we know we can get three other players in, in double figures. So she did a very good job of making shots early. We did a very good job of getting up and down the floor. And I really thought that early in the game that, that Brianna Day got some, got some easy looks at, at the rim, got some good dump offs, and, and she was a big big part of our success for the night also. Tell me about the game of uh, Alexis Peterson, matched her career high with a 19 points. Uh, how'd she do a uh, run in the show and certainly score on the ball for you? Well, it's, it's, it's a tough game we have, Lex, because she has a control tempo, push ball, play great defense for extended minutes on the floor. She's done an excellent job of getting us into our stuff and, and, and pushing tempo. So I'm very, very proud of what, what she's doing, and she's done a very good job of keeping us going. Well, before we turn our attention to Brianna Day herself, what do you think about uh, Brianna's game here today? I thought Brianna was great today. She, she did a very good job on the, on the glass for us early in the game. She got some got some, got some easy baskets and got us, got us broke, really broke the game open for us. And she's, she's been doing an excellent job night in and night out for us. So hopefully we can, we can continue to keep this going throughout the season. All right, Q, congratulations. We'll see you tomorrow. Let's turn now to Brianna Day. Brianna, 13 points. 10 rebounds, you really had it going inside today. What was this matchup like and what allowed you guys to get out to that early lead? We just had to keep playing hard. We knew they were a physical team and we were prepared for that, so we just had to go hard every possession. And I think that's what helped us a lot. How much does it help you that you're a pressing team yourself, so you're used to dealing with it, even though theirs is very aggressive and we're able to take advantage? Uh, we're, we're used to it because, I mean, we do it ourselves. We just had to keep calm, like play our game, not let them take us out of our element. I think we did a really good job of that. What were you thinking when you see your classmate Alexis Peterson really get going like she did? Yeah, I know I know it's in her. Like she, she can do that every game if she wants to. So I know she can do it. So I'm not surprised. I'm very proud of her because she really worked hard scoring the ball, running the team. So I'm proud of her. And what was the action like for you today? Obviously, when it's going to be an up-and-down game like that, you're really going to have to move for a post. How was your game getting really the full 94? I mean, it was good. I mean, just running since I'm pretty fast. Just run on them, and that's what we have to do a lot of times, just run, especially if they're so aggressive and, and they're trapping and pressing. We just have to run on them and get open looks. All right, Brianna, rest up. We'll see you again tomorrow. All right, thank you. All right, that's uh, Brianna Day. Syracuse taking on the winner of the game, about to tip here between South Carolina and Wisconsin. 8 o'clock tip tomorrow night here in the Bahamas. Be sure to check back to Q's TV.